Hi, my name is Professor Matt Baker, and I'm going to be teaching the Law and Human Rights class in the fall of 2018. By way of introduction, I'm right now an assistant public defender with the Office of the Public Defender for the Ninth Judicial Circuit that's here in Orange County and Osceola County. I've been there for the last four and a half years where I've uh, defended people charged with anything from um, possession of, of marijuana all the way up to attempted second degree murder. Um, the last couple years, I've been helping out here at UCF in the mock trial program as one of the team coaches. And this semester, I'm teaching in American National Government, the political science department. So this class is going to talk about human rights. Um, we're going to start with a discussion of the historical um, human rights movement when it started and the legal processes that were built in as part of this expansion of um, of law during that period. So the first part of the, the class is going to focus on those historical sources and the um, kind of the mechanisms that started human rights um, process globally. Then we're going to talk about the current core, um, current processes that exist in human rights, the treaties that exist between countries, as well as the international courts uh, that exist. A large section of the class, the middle part, is going to talk about, each week we're going to talk about su substantive human rights. Things like freedom of conscience and expression, economic, social, and cultural rights, um, the law of privacy, uh, things like that that exist um, both in the U.S. and globally. And then finally, the last section of the class is going to talk a lot about human rights and war, uh, things like genocide, crimes against humanity. Um, how those fit into the international legal system and human rights. The class is going to have one book. It's going to be uh, International Human Rights and Humanitarian Law. It'll be a case book that has lots of reading materials for us to use in it. I also plan on supplementing that with videos and podcasts as well as uh, articles, uh, depending on what the week's topic is. The assessments in the class are going to be... Um, one midterm exam after we talk about the process parts of the class and then later on in the class there'll be a midterm paper that's due that'll focus on one of the topics we discuss in the substantive human rights section and at the end of the semester everyone's going to have a presentation that they're going to share with the class about a particular issue that they decide um, it can be something about the paper or something even totally different this class is going to be discussion driven so that means that we're each week we're going to talk about the things we've read. Um, not going to be as lecture-heavy focus. It's going to definitely be driven by you, the students. My goal is for it to be kind of like a law school seminar in that we kind of have an open discussion and students can kind of um, learn from each other just as much as we're learning from the casebook and from those lectures. So I look forward to the chance of having you in my class in the fall of 2018. It's going to be called Law and Human Rights. Thanks.